Challenge accepted. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. We are both fired up to watch this EA SHL showdown. And we are about set to drop the puck tonight. The Heat have established possession here early in this one as they win the draw. Big time stop. The Coyotes scoop it up along the boards. And now it's grabbed by Abbott. And he can't hang on after that hit. Sends the pass over. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Accolades plays it against the boards. Centering pass. Oh, if there's going to be a regret in this one, that might be it. Yeah, that play is right there to be had. They just miss the pass. The scoring chance goes away. Nice pass. Abbott's going to play it against the half wall. Not able to connect. Oh, what a missed chance that was. Yeah, he's got to make a better play there. He's done everything right. Now you just got to get the puck on the tape. Tucson's got a hold of it against the wall. And no one's blocked! And he coughs it up with the pass. Tees him up! Oh, what a reactionary save on the one-timer! Scooped up along the wall by Katza. Here's a chance! Long jam in front, that's broken up. Lifts the stick and takes the puck. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. Moves the puck to O'Brien. Cappy's got it in the defensive end. And now he angles it across to Abbott. Moves it quickly over to Akalazi. Denied by the goaltender. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. We're still scoreless. Tucson's won the faceoff deep in their own end. Cuts a stick handling in his own zone. And the linesman calls icing on the play. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. Accolades is quick on the draw. You can be a little more aggressive here. You know the other team's tired. They just want to get the puck and clear the zone. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. his own face off and he wins the draw just wide they say it's a game of inches James if that puck is a couple of inches to the side that hits the post and goes in stays with it here's a short pass to Santos inside the offensive zone excellent stick work on the play and that shot gets caught in traffic heads to the back of the net Stockton's gained possession along the boards quick feed to Franco nice poke check Grabs control of it at the point. Here's a shot. Gets in front of it. Tucson's got it in their own zone. Slides the puck across to LeBlanc. And that's picked off. Gains the zone through center. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. Past the midway mark in this period. Still no score in this one. the draw and he ties up his opponent nice dish from the left wing Katz has got the puck through the neutral zone oh and a good heads up defensive play Augustin's lugging the puck and now he moves it to Katza. slides the puck down low moves it up set it out in front and he easily stops that one Tucson's got it in the offensive zone. Too much congestion in front. One-on-one -on -one with the goaltender. And he comes up with a big stop on the breakaway. Almost like the shooter waited and waited, and the opening never came. Offside is the call. It will have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. Here in the late goings of the period, the game is still scoreless. 
And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. Cuts to the paint. Turns him away. And we'll get a face-off after that save as the puck sails out of bounds. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. The Heat have possession along the boards. Moves it to Abbott. Takes control of the puck. The Coyotes have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Turns the puck over. Great read defensively there. Takes the pass. Whoa. Scores! Stockton's on the board here. They've got the opening goal of the game here late in the opening frame. All you want after the first is to be even or ahead. They've done most of it. Now you have to finish the job. He clearly doesn't like that. Augustin's not interested in dropping the mitts and going at it. Right in front. Scores. They barely fished the puck out after the last one. Two goals in 70 seconds. Wow, insane how quick that was. Bang, bang. Yeah, the defending team just couldn't put a stake in the ground. They couldn't stop them. Tucson's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. Finds nothing but air on that shot. Taken along the wall by Abbott. Great chance in front. Stopped by the goaltender. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. Stockton's execution has been on point so far here in this first period. Puts it on net. Scores! Well, timing is everything. Is it ever? That's a kick in the pants to give up one that late. But that should give the other team some momentum going into the next period. Stockton's been the better team here in the late stage of this first period. More shots, more goals. Simple as that. And there's the horn mercifully bringing this first period to an end. Well, the first 20 is in the books. Let's see what this second period offers. A one-sided affair after the first 20 minutes. Here we go for period number two. One period already in the books. Ray, how have you seen this thing? Tucson's probably in a spot that they deserve to be in. They haven't had to puck very much. Of course they're going to be chasing the game. Laplace taking it from his own end. Dishes it to Santos. And now he tries to get it across to Katza. Play whistle dead because of an offside. Stockton's been the more aggressive team offensively. Look at the shot clock and just look at the score. Off the draw and a nice job locking up his opponent. The Heat have gained control of the puck along the wall. Quick pass to Franco. Grabs the puck at center. Here's an offensive chance. Great save from in tight. Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck. In close, he takes away any room. Taken by O'Brien. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. And now it's over to O'Brien. Steps in front of the shot. And the puck skips out of play. Someone gets a souvenir, and we'll get a faceoff. Stockton's got the lead here early in this second period. Their offense has been clicking at all cylinders thus far. Puck picked up by Katza. Moves it quickly over to LeBlanc and tries to make a diagonal pass to Katza. And that banks off a stick. Stockton's got the puck. Couldn't complete the play. The Coyotes gain possession along the wall. Santos takes it inside his own end. A howitzer denies him with the save. Who's the puck? Save made by the goalie. Really good stop. After he made the first one, he's got to find the puck, and he's in position again. Stockton's offense came to play in a big way, and they lead big time here in the second. 
Accolades wins possession in the defensive zone. Stockton's looking to break out. From the point, looks to make something happen. Franco's been brought down, and we're going to get a penalty here. There's the whistle. And let's hear what the official's explanation on this one is. Cuts us getting two for tripping. Always a little careless to get a tripping penalty. You get your stick into the player's feet, and when he goes down, you're going to go to the box. And they get the puck out of harm's way. Steps across the blue line. That's a solid check on the play. And now he moves it quickly to O'Brien. Moves the puck along the half wall. Aaron pass, and the play's broken up. Tries to get it out of their own end. And they do just that. Oh, I thought they did a pretty good job there, James. That's a time you can get yourself running around in the zone. They didn't get there. Here's a short pass to Cappy. Slides the puck over. Abbott's got it along the wing. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. They don't score on the power play, but they accomplish a little bit here. They melt some time off the clock. They don't need the goal, but they don't want to make any big mistakes. And that one's stolen at center ice. Stockton's dominance tonight can be attributed to the way that they played positionally. They've smothered the game, and they are way out in front. Tucson's got it in their own zone. Sends a pass over. Receives the puck in the corner. You'll need more than that to beat him. Past the midway mark of the frame. Stockton's on easy street right now. They lead it 3-0. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Denied by the goaltender. He's working hard to find this puck. There's all kinds of traffic in front of him, and he gets to it before the puck gets to him. Cuts has got it in the defensive end. Nice speed at center moves up ahead now. The Heat have the puck against the boards. Accolades takes it across the line. Right out in front, and that one's broken up. Feeds the puck across to Santos. Drives to the sweet spot. Icing is called, stopping the play dead. Getting into the later stages of this period, Stockton's got a 3-0 lead. They have been in control right from the start. The Coyotes gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. Moving into the attacking zone. Tucson's looking to break out of their own end. Couldn't complete the play. Couldn't find the intended target. Here's a race for the loose puck. Takes the feed. Stockton's got the puck along the wall. Huge steal in his own end. Big play inside the defensive zone. Handles the pass from the right wing. Centering pass. Accolades will play it to the corner. Couldn't make that one happen. Nothing doing on that. O'Brien's caught up with the hook, and the official saw it. Play is stopped, and here's the official call. Augustin's going to get two for hooking on the play. So quickly into position, now the defensive player's got to scramble. He takes the hooking penalty. And he slides it quickly to Abbott. There's another stop. Great chance. Wrapper on in front. What a stop. Yeah, that's a race to the post. The goalie wins it there, gets the pad flat to make the save. There's the horn ending period number two. I'm not sure they wanted it to end.
are just moments away from the start of the third period. Stockton's power play gets back to work here as we are underway in the period. They win the draw. The Heat have taken to the offensive attack. Tucson's penalty killers get a hold of it. Trying to get it down the ice. Grabs the puck here in their own end. And he gets the job done. Big thumbs up clearing that one. Made the stop on the play. Stockton's got the puck in the defensive end. Quick feed to Akalatsi. The Coyotes move to the offensive zone. Stockton's got control of it now from their own end. Moves it to Franco. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. Augustin's back out onto the ice as we are back to even strength here. These are the power plays that drive coaches crazy. They didn't really generate anything. They didn't force the penalty killers at all. Kind of a waste of time. Looks to get the puck over to Santos. Nice defensive robbery with the stick. Knocked around but keeps it going. Tucson's got a hold of it against the wall. Getting a little too physical to maintain possession. Stretch pass. The Heat have taken over in the neutral zone. Strong defensive effort. Can't connect. Puck scooped up by Katza. And now he angles it across to Santos. Tucson's on the attack. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Quick pass to Franco. Quick feed down low. What a steal in his own end. Handles the puck. Offside the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the blue line. Stockton's offense has been the story tonight, leading big time here in this third period. Nice job tying up his opponent. Can't keep a hold of the puck after that play. Picked up along the boards by Katza. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. And here's the official call as play is whistled dead. Franco's been nabbed for tripping. He's fishing around trying to get to the puck. Unfortunately for him, he sweeps out his feet. Uh -huh. Moves it quickly over to Katza. Receives the pass. Oh, they telegraphed the pass and he picks it off. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. And the puck is cleared to a safer spot. Picked up along the wall by Katza. With possession along the wall. Here he is in close. Stopped by the goaltender. This is a quality chance that the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. Cappy's got the puck in his own zone. And a successful clearing attempt. Tucson's going to play the puck from behind the cage. And as both teams are now back at even strength, the power play goes over on the opportunity. I can't imagine the coaches are going to be very happy with that. This is a really good piece of video to show the players, though, because you show them great. You had it in the zone, but there was no danger generated on that power play. Takes it into the slot, and he gets a paddle on that one. Smothered that in close chance. Here's a short pass to Katza. Play is blown dead. We've got a penalty on the way. O'Brien's not going to like the call, but the officials see tripping on the play. I always found this a frustrating penalty to take. There's really no aggression to it. You're trying to steal the puck, but you end up flipping the guy down. And manages to clear the zone. Tucson's got the puck in their own end. Stockton's got possession while undermanned. Tries to feed it over to Akalatsi. Tucson's got the puck along the boards. The Coyotes are in transition. Grabs the puck here inside the offensive end. Great read to break up the play. Unable to reach that one. Tucson's got it behind the net. Takes the feed. Smart heads up play to intercept the pass. There's the whistle, and a penalty is coming up on this one. The Coyotes will serve two for slashing. The sound the slash makes off the equipment alerts the referee. If you're going to slash him, look for the spot with no padding. And it's four against four here with the puck set to drop. 
This is the time, James, you get your skilled guys into the game more frequently. Four on four is open ice. It's danger if you have skill, and the team with the most skill is probably going to be the best. Makes the save. And as he steps back out onto the ice, they'll go to work with the man advantage here. Off the left wing and into center. Takes a shot just wide. The Heat have gained control of the puck along the wall. Here's an opportunity to clear the zone. And no luck with that one. Tucson's got the puck along the wall. A chance in front. Can't connect. Stockton's gained possession along the boards. Takes the pass in the offensive zone. His reflexes on display tonight. Sends it across. Well, the power play melts away. They don't get anything on it. I don't think it's particularly important because they've got such a nice lead here. They just want to run the clock out. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. The Coyotes look to start the transition game. Can't connect. Stockton's gained possession. Pokes it away in his own end. Cappy's got it in the defensive zone. And just hitting the final minute now in regulation of this blowout. Sends the pass over. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Stopping the play. We're going to have to flip these guys a rule book over there. They're offside all the time. Here in the later stages of this period, 3-0 is the score. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Can't catch up to the pass. There's the whistle icing the call. The centermen glide into position. Tucson's won the draw and they'll go to work. The cannon from the point! Slides it up to Abbott. Picking up ahead of steam on the breakaway! Nice hands, great finish, little short break, and it's in the net. Stockton's having a lot of fun out there tonight, but Ray, I can imagine it's a different story on the other side of the bench. Yeah, half the guys out here are having fun. The other half, this game can't end quick enough. Puck grabbed by O'Brien, and it's a quick pass to Atalatze. Along the half wall with the puck. Referee Gillivec's hand is in the air. We've got a penalty coming up. Gillivec blows the whistle, and someone is off to the box. Interference is the call here, Ray. If he moves his feet just a little bit more, he's in better position. Accolades has won the faceoff. Just slide to the net. And loses possession after a solid hit. What a stop as he puts out the fire. Clearing attempt. And he moves the puck across the blue line out of the defensive zone. Right on the doorstep. Oh, and he missed the opportunity there. That's all she wrote from this one tonight. Well, Razor, you want to sum this one up for us? Yeah, bad choice, bad decisions. We've all made them. Those guys just made one. I believe the term is stay in your lane.